everybody. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 10. Yeah. Same I still got it. I still got it, Dan. Today, or tonight I should say, we are downtown Buffalo because we are going to check out the Christmas market. Christmas market. So this is the first time ever that Buffalo has had a Christmas market. They're calling it a European style Christmas market. We'll see how it is. Um, I don't know how close it's going to be, at least this year. Maybe they'll incorporate more and more things next year. But there's also a market going on at the Hofbrau House. I don't know if it's still going on today. We'll have to take a look at it. Um, cause maybe we could pop over there too, because it's real close. Um, that one I assume would probably be really more European. Potentially. Potentially. But, we're gonna go check it out. I smelled some food, I don't know if it's coming from the casino, the bar restaurant, or the, um, uh, market. But, I do know that they have some food, they have snacks and desserts and all that fun stuff. <clears throat> so, we're gonna go over and check it out and see what it's all about. The inaugural year. Fun stuff. Absolutely. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, also, I didn't mention this, but the weather's gross today, y'all. Yeah. Like, it's like 60 degrees. It's rainy. And it's windy. windy. I mean, it's not really rainy anymore, but it was raining just a little bit ago. It's, it's gross. It is not prime market going yeah. weather. Not However, we could come back next week, but I don't know. It's, it's better just to go now to enjoy it. Yeah. I mean, I feel like I saw pictures of people like the first weekend that it was open. And it was like, snow was coming down. I'm like, that is the Christmas market I envision. Not this. Green, wet, and gross. Boo. Anyways, <laughs> let's go check it out. Also, I would just like to point out that living near General Mills is amazing because I can smell Lucky Charms right now. Yep. When I worked at the Buffalo Sabres store, when I'd be leaving there at night, I would smell Lucky Charms and then I'd have to have them. So we had to make sure that we kept them on hand in the house so I could have a bowl of cereal. <laughs> because it's right over there. Right over there. Right over there. Right over there. All right, let's go. All right, everybody. So we went to the little market. It's very tiny. Cute idea. Cool, huh? Very tiny. Hopefully, um, with people interested, they might be able to expand in the in the coming years. You know, once it's in everybody's mind that it's a thing. Yeah. Um, we went by the Chris Kindle Mark um, at Hofbrau House, and it doesn't look like any of the booths are open today. So maybe we'll pop back down on Saturday and see. Might be, might be some more activity on the weekend. I don't know if maybe they closed because of the weather, because it is pretty windy. So maybe they just didn't open the, the booths up today. I was gonna look at their Facebook page, but I didn't get a chance to yet. So I'll see if they put anything on it, because I was monitoring the Christmas markets one to see if they were gonna close because of the wind. The wind's not terrible down here, but it can pick up quickly. We'll still have to go check out Southern Tier Brewing, maybe yeah. before one of the Bisons, or Bisons, yeah. one of the Bandits games. games or something. Yeah. Um, but they used to be 716 Bar and Grill, now it is um, owned and operated by Southern Tier Brewing Company, which is cool because 716 was a cool idea and it, it was nice to have a big sports restaurant down here, but the food was never that great. Like, it was okay, but it wasn't the best. And they were called 716, and they didn't even have very good chicken wings. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, how are you yeah. gonna be 716 and not have good chicken wings? Yeah. So, now with Southern Tier, hopefully their menu will be better, and since it's a brewery, 
they have some good beers too so and they kept the layout the same and they kept like the ginormous TV that's like two floors high um, which is pretty fun to sit in there and and watch it so <laughs> pretty cool pretty cool place pretty, pretty, pretty cool, cool place um, but we'll have to go check it out again just need the ice to freeze. It yeah, there's an ice rink down here, which you can't really see, but you can see the glowingness of off the water that is left behind. I mean, but, you're with this last year. We went down there last year, right? Um, I believe we went down there last year during Vlogmas. I think it was the, year, year, before, before, the yeah. year before. Because last year, I, th right, I don't yeah. think it was open. Yeah, right. It might it might have been, but I don't know. Yeah. Um, the year before, that's right. Yeah, definitely went down there. Yeah, but been skating in a long time. Long time. So, Too long. Yeah. So hopefully we could get down there this year at some point. So okay. Stay tuned for the weekly vlogs in the new year and you might see it. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> but we're gonna head home and then we'll show you we got a couple little goodies from the market that we'll show you. Um there wasn't a lot of people and it wasn't very overwhelming which was kind of nice I guess. Yeah was, um, well, there was not that many people yeah because it's a very tight, tight space. space so if there's a lot of people there it's probably crazy but yeah. we'll just need to go if they don't up their game we're just gonna have to go to Chicago and see that Chris Kindle market because ever since I saw the Brookhart project there a couple years like when I first started watching their vlog miss all I wanted to do is go there so we have to go pay pay a little visit to the Windy City <laughs> Maybe say hi, maybe say hi to the Brookhearts <laughs> and go to the market. But until then, we'll uh, we'll have what we have. <laughs> All right, let's head home. Well, everyone, surprise, surprise! <laughs> the wind kicks up to hefty gusts and the power goes out yet again. Wah, wah, wah. Luckily, we just finished cooking dinner. Like literally just finished cooking. Well, like I was gonna reheat the green, put the green beans in the microwave for longer because they were left over from yesterday. And the minute I opened the microwave door, the power went out. Luckily we have, well we have all of our battery operated like candles. candles, we have a headlamp, we have battery operated Christmas lights, our star is battery operated, so that's still, still lit. Working. But the other side of the street, again, does not look affected. So, our side of the street, downright sucks. Yeah, I think more often than not, it's our side. Mm -hmm. I think their side's been out and our side's been on, like, maybe once. Maybe. Maybe. Tw it's definitely once, maybe twice. <sighs> I don't know. But, let's eat some dinner, shall we? Yay. We were just about to watch the Sabres game, too. It was, literally was just starting. Yep. Not no. anymore. Because we're not watching that. <laughs> All right, so by our candlelight here, we'll try to show you some of the things that we got at the market. The Green first, market. we got a red standing buffalo ornament, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. Because it's also one of the retro Bills logos. So I don't know if that's what they were going for, if they were just going for buffalo. But either way, it works. Yeah. So... I thought it was kind of cool. Yep. The Standing Buffalo logo was always my dad's favorite Bill's logo, so. Mm -hmm. Good find. We got a Christmas tree sugar cookie. And you can't, I don't know if you could tell, but it's got like a sparkle, like an edible glitter on it. So it sparkles. I'm really excited. And the bakery that we got it from, we've tried their uh, cake before. Because... Um, Dan's brother and our sister-in-law had it for their wedding, and also we went there to try cakes before our wedding as well. Mm -hmm. We didn't end up going with them, but we went with a good old Polish bakery. Pretty good, though. Yeah. Um, so I'm excited about that. <clears throat> we also got some popcorn from a place called What's Poppin'? What's Poppin'? Gourmet popcorn. We got cinnamon kettle corn and sour cream and onion. Dan really wanted the, what was it? Garlic parm. Garlic yeah. parm, but they were all out, so. And you can hear the wind on our house, and it's, it's unnerving. <laughs> Minorly unsettling. Minorly unsettling. But we're going to try some, some kettle corn, because, uh, because why, why not? not, right? Yeah. You yep. want salty first, or 
Yeah, we'll go with savory first. They have a sour cream and onion taste. Yeah, it's not like super in your mm. face about it either. I dropped one. You made a mess. It was only one. It's good. Mm -hmm. Fresh, sweet. Sure. Mm. Yep. What's hard is that? I love cinnamon. Cinnamon. <laughs> what? That might be all you. <laughs> Is it very cinnamon? Yep. Like a fireball. That's like a fireball cut up over. Kind of is. I just want That's all weird. you. Oh, we're going to put it on popcorn now. Estimated power back on was 1015. So, we'll it's hope. It's really 830. I hope that that's correct because I don't want to go into the office tomorrow to work. Yeah. I'm scheduled to work from home. And if there's no power? Then I have to. You have to go in? And I don't want to. Hopefully I'll be back. Hopefully. There was a lot of crews waiting around here in Buffalo and there were already there like... a lot of crews waiting the last time too. That's true. Maybe last time the damage was... Might have been more serious. Yeah. Hopefully it was more serious last time. Yeah. Well, the wind was higher last time than it is yeah. now, so... We'll keep you all updated with the power. We want the power! Give us power back now! Boom! 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 Obviously. <laughs> Why wouldn't it? That's the question. Okay. That was like That was awesome. Amazing. <laughs> I forgot that I still had a Christmas movie downloaded to Disney Plus on the iPad, so winning! and it's fully charged so we can watch a movie it's candlelight advent <laughs> calendar time cha -cha -cha. yeah we're gonna do this with our our lights so we have a available and a mickey ornament right there nice we're gonna do the cheese tomorrow because we don't want to open the refrigerator, so. Correct. Let's see. It's the 16th, right? Mm hmm Time to hunt for last year's wrapping paper? Is that a question mark? Yeah, question, it's a question mark. Question mark? Question mark. <clears throat> With an upward inflection? Mm hmm Poor Angel. Sorry, Angel. Mm. I'll open up Cure Glow in here. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. By the way, everybody, I'm down to only one more coffee and one hot chocolate left over. So you're going to make them tonight, but. I'm no make power. Sure plans. Maybe later. Costa Rica para... Paraiso? All right. 16. What fancy chocolate shall we have tonight? Ooh, that's a new one. Salted espresso martini. Ooh, that's going to be good. For you, probably. <laughs> For you. You like coffee. A martini, though. No. Huh? Not martini. I don't think it's going to taste like vodka or gin. Although the champagne one did taste like champagne, so. <laughs> Does it taste alcohol -y at all or no? A little bit. Interesting. I smell it. Mm -hmm. Okay, everybody. It is. What's the time? Time to get a watch. 
don't know. Oh, my phone's over here. Give me a flight. Your phone's being, being used for the light. I don't know what time it is. 9.12. It is 9.12. So hopefully within an hour or so we will have our power back. We shall see. We'll probably let you know tomorrow if we have the power back on. We'll see. Um, we'll see if we film any more tonight. But we're just going to sit and watch the Santa Claus 2. And Dan's just going to start editing while the laptop has a full charge. Um, hopefully... We'll still get the vlogging up at a decent time tomorrow, but who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Whatever they have in store for us, <laughs> hopefully the uh, electric company will be on it and the time will be correct for when it will be back on. I keep finding hairs all over me. Mm -hmm. But thanks for joining us for a, another day of Vlogmas. And... Not a hair on you. <laughs> and we will see you all tomorrow. We have another fun Christmas yeah. activity to do tomorrow night. I know tonight wasn't super exciting. We didn't really know what was going to all be at the market. Um, but we might still go back Saturday for um, the Chris Kindle market at Hofbrau House. We might go check it out because it, out. it might be a little bit more Christmassy feeling and they might have more things that are like typical European Chris Kindle markets there. So fingers crossed. We could get there. I'm pretty sure we can. We don't really have any plans Saturday, so. All right. We will see you all tomorrow, hopefully, with power. Good night.